Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial. This time I'll show you how you can add your WSL instance to Termius. First, let's check the WSL distro that I have already installed in my system using WSL-L. As you can see, I have at least three distro. Let's explore all the three distro using Windows Explorer. If I go to Linux folder, you can see all the three distros are here. We'll add this distro first. So let's activate this distro with WSL-D where D stands for distro and then add the distro name. So I'm already inside the distro. If I run CD then CD dash dash. Now run LS and navigate to the user folder. Let me navigate to this location using Windows Explorer 2, which is this one, and then home, SAB, which is my username, and there should be a folder called hello. If you run ls-a, you can see the folder name in the command line too, and you can see all the hidden files as well. Okay, so everything is fine now. We need to connect WSL Distro to Termius, right? The first step is to know the IP address of this distro. We can get the IP address of this current distro by running IP ADDR command. There is a lot of text here, but we should focus on this line. And if you are confused about what to focus on, I have already written an article in my blog where I have marked the area where you should focus on. Anyway, let's copy the IP address and open Termias. Click on the new host and paste the IP address. We can call it Ubuntu 22.04 WSL and then insert the credential. The port should be 22. Everything is fine and, and if I press connect now, you can see it is now working, right? As usual, I can run the ls command and you can see the hello folder. I can run mkdir and name the folder as test and if I navigate to the folder again and reload, you can see it's working. In this case, the WSL distro added smoothly because I already configured this distro earlier. Exit from this distro, we will add another WSL distro to Termias. Let's clear the terminal. Run WSL-L to list all the available distros. Now we're going to add this distro named as Ubuntu 22.04 underscore import. Close the Termius windows that we opened earlier. Copy the distro name, then run WSL-D and then paste the distro name. So we're inside the distro. If we navigate to the home directory, then user folder, you can see I have an app folder here. Let me double check again by navigating to the same location using Windows Explorer. If I now run ls-a command, you can see all the hidden folders too. Let's try to connect this distro to Termius. Again, we will start by running the IP ADDR command to find the IP address. Copy the IP address and open Termias. Click on the new host and paste the IP address. Copy the distro name for the level and then insert the credentials. The port should be 22. You can notice that this time it is not working. The reason is in this distro, I don't have the OpenSSH server installed. So if you check my website, you can notice that I have mentioned that we must install OpenSSH-server to access the WSL from Termius. So we must install both of this package. Let's run both of the commands one by one. The first one is sudo apt update. and then sudo apt install open ssh hyphen server.
once installed we can run ipaddr again and copy the ip address to Termius. This time Termius should be able to connect with our WSL instance. If you notice warning about fingerprint, it's better to replace the fingerprint. As you can see, we have successfully connected WSL with Termius. So that is all for today. Feel free to browse my website where I have listed all the required commands and instructions step by step. Uh, thank you for watching this tutorial. We'll see you again. Thank you.